He's my five favorite moves with Jack that you're gonna be seeing me running around doing a lot. There's standing two. This is Jack's jab. Most characters' jabs are with one. Most characters jab with one, but Jack's jab is actually two. It's one frame slower than every other character's jab, which at 10, Jack's is 11. But it's got way more range. So if you do two, it can't be interrupted by an attack. It can only trade with their other jab. So you can do this to set the tone. Like two jabs. Or even three. It's like a getting in thing. Jack, of course, definitely wants to be up close and personal with your opponent. When I get in close, I like to sneak in these lows. Sometimes I open up with a jab, sometimes I don't, and I just go straight for the low. What's the trade advantage? It's whatever you hit him with, whatever the hit properties are, or whatever. Sometimes I like to get in with a down back one. Um, he used to have this move, full couch down back one. It was different, but now they've changed it a little bit. It's a little bit slower, it's got more range, and it's part of a weird three hit string. So, how good is that? We don't know yet. But I see a lot of Jack players and myself, we're going to be doing our first two hits. You can stand crouching and run this infinite. <laughs> it's pretty good. Or you could do something like that. You know, just run a little down, full crouch, down back, one one game. Or you can just do that a lot. Third hit, if you charge it, it makes it safe, but otherwise, it's going to be punishable. I think the best new standalone move that he's got, running one plus two. Gets his old shoulder. Kami is lit. Thank you for the sub. It's the running shoulder. Big advantage on. Uh, big advantage on block. Not big, but big enough. Plus three. It is steppable, so be careful when you want to use it. Afterwards, you know, you can do whatever mix up you want. So the main move that you mix up your lows with is uh, it's going to be down 4 1 for safety. Or 4 4 1. But if you want to mix up 4 4 1 with the down back one, I suggest you use the down back one off of the 4 forward so it looks similar. Dashing in, dashing in. If I'm just standing still and I do this a lot, it's not going to be a good mix up with standing still and doing 4 4 1 because the timing is different. You have to make the timing similar. Now that this doesn't knock down anymore. I like to just knock people with a down back one afterwards. And then the last move that I think is very, very good with Jack. It's not a move that you use during neutral or on incoming, but it's the number one punisher that he's got. If they whiff, great range, down forward two, leads to a combo. Whatever combo you choose. So again, the standing two, it's the down back one, and the full couch down back one. It's the four, four, one to mix up with the lows. It's the running. And this running move is best used after your combos. And the opponent's trying to get up. So let's do this combo. They get up, I run in, and I get my advantage. I get my advantage after the combo. Run in, get my advantage. You need to know about his heat engager moves, the primary one being this one. This is also a good move to mix up the lows with because it's a fast mid that's plus five on block, but with the pushback, you really only get to take advantage of the plus frames when their back's to the wall. This one has a little bit more range, but it is unsafe. I think a lot of people are not gonna be punishing it optimally though, and if you use them at far ranges, there's a little bit of pushback, so it's challenging to punish. So I use this a lot as my heat engager. It's just something I can throw out when I'm dashing up. You know, people might be trying to block my lows. And if I notice that they're not trying to block my lows, I'll use a lot more of these lows on them. They add up really quickly. But on the heat engager, I run in. That's a perfect time to get your running move, the running one plus two. If you want to feel frisky, you can run running two. Running two is slow, but it actually guarantees a free hit afterwards. Plus ten. So you get that. Or if you're in heat state, you can do the smash. Also new in this game is down forward four. This kick right here. On counter hit, you get the free back one plus two. This is a 
good for tracking as well. You know? So these moves that I'm listing now, like the back twos, the down 404, these are like the secondary moves. The moves that you're using with the primary stuff. With these moves, you know? I'll be using throws. Throws are greatly buffed in this game, and Jack's one of the best grapplers in the game. So if I remember, I'll be using throws, because I don't like to throw a lot. And then my last secondary favorite move to use is a 4-3. You see how it puts him in the flex stance, the gamma stance. This is also new in the game. It's also new in the game, but I'll explain that as I go. Okay? How important is the blue hand? Not important anymore because in this game, if you press 1 plus 4, he'll do this. So you do 1 plus 4 and then down 4 at 1 really quickly. It's a lot easier to do. But you sacrifice some damage. The main thing to know in the, the stance is that when you're in the heat uh, state, his uh, stance 2 option, guard breaks. So you can do... So you can do uh, stance two to the heat smash. It uses up all your heat, but it's a lot of free damage. It is a high though. So to mix it up, stance one, while you're in heat state, it gives a free combo. Um, and it's not only in heat state when you uh, have those powered up options. 3 plus 4, the manual input for the uh, uh, Fat When you have the manual input, if he absorbs an attack, because this is a power crush. If you... If you absorb an attack with the stance... What the hell? There we go. If you absorb an attack, it actually charges up the punch option. As if you were in the heat. But in the heat state, all the, the both punches options are automatically the powered up versions. You can do a couple of other moves from the stance. Ready for the next battle. But yep, 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 yep. I'll be doing those moves now. And I'll show off the, the stance stuff as I go along. Remember the plan is to run around doing lows, doing mids, and punishing whiffs. Fight. When I pop it with the low, while setting four is good to check the whiff. Here's my move right here. Special pancake strat. Don't try that at home, kids. That's for the pros only. <laughs> for the pros only. That's my whip punisher. Let's go downstairs. Bomb, bomb. Run up after every knockdown. He'll be saying that a lot. After every knockdown, I love the running shoulder. Fight. Running shoulder. And then back to nice side steps. Running shoulder. Oh, he's not falling for it. Running shoulder. Okay. Side step a lot. Sidestep a lot, brother. Down four at one is a safe way to catch people sidestepping. If you want a big payoff, you do four four one plus two clapper. I'll try to land a little clapper for y'all. Or the down four four kick. Counter hit, easy to confirm. That's the clapper. There's a little stomper move on 4-3. That's the mid. Because everybody knows about the high guard breaking. So they're going to duck. Wow, wow. Oh. oh, my stuff's not working. 
Yeah, that one stops the sidestepping and the jabbing. That's a punish. Dun, dun, dun. But anyways, if they size up a lot, this move ain't gonna be as great. You're gonna have to really get them to stop size stepping with that move, maybe. Let's guard break. Let's. Oh no, guard break. Okay. He's really against the guard break. So if I notice that he's really against the guard break, then I'll just run the one option a lot more. Get ready for the next battle. After my lows, he was doing a lot of sidestepping, and this wall standing two will catch as well. Wall standing two is a classic. Never mind. Get ready for the next battle. Well, yeah, I demonstrated a lot of what I said in practice mode that game. Every knockdown, running shoulder, use the heat engager back to pop them with lows, pop them with mids. Shoulder, low, low. Keep out. I use that as keep out sometimes if I can read their movement. It's kind of advanced. 2-3 is a great punisher. 2-3. It's new as well. You used to punish with 2-1. But now you get 2-3, which is a little more damage. But I recommend only using it to punish. Yeah, on the wall, like I said, that's where that gunshot, that back 2 is going to be good. Wow, they can't go anywhere. There's no pushback. So when I get to the wall, I'm going ham. I'm shooting. Counter. Let's do it again. Uh. Oh my god! How many times are we going to shoot? Oh, never? No shooting allowed. my smash. He's got the heat, fastest heat smash in the game. That's really cool though. The fastest heat smash in the game. Huh. This is guaranteed after that low. While setting two after the lows like I said. Oh, he jabs after that. I mean, they're jabbing after that gunshot. You can do whatever you want. Whatever you want. You win. Can I get a rematch, Denny? Thank you. How negative is the neck? That shot is plus five. But the pushback. Oh. The pushback make. Can't block it. The pushback is hard to take advantage of the plus frames. That's why I said on the wall, you can do a lot. Bam. And when you do that kick on the wall, you get a really strong follow up. Because there's no pushback on that kick as well. He's chilling now. Did he learn his lesson? Let's see what we can do. No good. I do want to show off some of the heat stuff. I like the stomp. It's a great way to force the issue. I don't want to burn my heat smash there, so I'll just do 2 3. Oh, 
pushback. I wish that follow-up guarantee was more consistent, you know? has so much range. No! No! Nice. <coughs> Final Let's go. Fight. Oh, what the hell? The sudden nunchucks. That was cool. I didn't get to go crazy on the wall like I wanted to show you guys. Get ready for the next battle. But yeah. This kick is plus 14, but because of the pushback, he has to do his long range move. Like right there, right? But on the wall, it's nasty. You can do 4 1 1, which is 14. And get the full combo. So that's what you're gonna see. So the combos with Jack are very simple. After I launch, you wanna do the tornado with uh, either 4 1 2 1, 1 2 1, or down 4 1 1. And whatever comes before that is just, it's not important. You can do something like this. Most players will do a kick, 4 1 2, and then. Oh, yeah, another way to do it. The, the, the pro way is uh, back 3-2, hold down. After back 3-2, you hold down, you go into the stance. The stance option is 4-1 for the tornado. So kick, 4-1-2, back 3-2, stance, tornado. That ender drops though. So you gotta do a two hit ender. I like 4-3, stance, 4. 4-3, hold down the stance. Any transition that you go into the stance is gonna be hold down. So if you do this move, hold down. That crouch throw is free, by the way. If you hit him with that little lunging move. Jack doesn't have like a hop kick. Or anything like that, like a panic move. So his number one panic move is 4-2. It's fast. So if you hit with a counter hit. Damn, I can't even show it. Get my ass beat. Get my ass beat, y'all. You do four, four you do four two, he's gonna fly back, then you can do four four four, the big boot. Alright, anyways, let's get back to the game plan. Big shoulders. He's just getting hit by the shoulders. Jack VPS? No, this ain't League of Legends, son. Throw. You got throw bricks? 
damage per shoulder. <laughs> Hell yeah. This is my heat combo. Run up. Blue hand. That's a good damage. DPS is good. Damage per shoulder. Jack is a good champion. Which champion y'all play? Which champion you guys main? That's a blue. Yeah, the blue hand does more damage than four. There are some situations where they fly back, where you can do blue hand. I'm trying to catch it with a. You can do blue hand there, but it's super hard. You do blue hand there. See, he's trying to start the pressure up. Bomb. Bomb. Is my Jack stronger than my Reina? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. It will be. Reina's got that new character, Luster. Very shiny. Very hard to know what she's doing. Shoulder. Shoulder. Man, if that shoulder was a heat engager, that would be nice. The fuck with Raven? I was playing Raven a little bit. I just learned it. No blocking low. Let's go ahead and open up the legs. Let's open up the legs. Well, he's kind of mixing up the ducking and not ducking. Tournament characters are gonna be Jack Eight and Jack Seven. Fight. Oh. Heat engager, not going for it, going for it there. Always shoulder. <laughs> Shooting! If you hold it, he does a super shot. A super shot. What's the command for the running shoulder? Forward, 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 one plus two. Get ready for the next battle. I'm sad they, they nerfed the range on my long range throw. I mean, long range shot. It used to be longer range, it used to be better at tracking. But yeah, by doing the running shoulder after all your engagers. You pretty much can get some kind of mix-up afterwards. Some little small shit. And if you want to do a big one, you can do the running two for way more plus frames. And by way more, I mean plus six. And if you really feel frisky, there's a third secret option. Bam! That one leaves them plus for forever. <laughs> this is a classic setup, by the way. What about don't use debug anymore? That shit sucks. This is half circle forward. Wow. You see how slow and linear it is. But it always this always works. Into the pancake. Down four, one plus three pancake. Oh man, I love it. Love it. Get ready for the next battle. Run it black, run it black. He should be much better against Jack than against Reyna. It doesn't seem like he knows what's going on against Reyna at all. Fight. J 
Jinnigan's Jinnigan's Jack seems strong. He can just parry a lot of my gamma stuff. Oh, he's in the corner. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Can't go nowhere. It's like where your biggest strength against Jack is your sidestepping when they're in the corner. Fuck! That's what you get when you fuck up the blue hand, so don't try that at home, kids. Everybody is ducking, man. It makes me sad. <laughs> Make me very sad. Streamers fight? Oh, Avery streams? Run a black a streamer? I, mean, I think he upgraded his PC because that shit used to really do bad. Oops. Gotta throw him, you gotta throw him. Did I play the story mode? I watched people play it. Oh, nice. Always run up and get your free shoulder. Oh my god. Uh, why did he get hit? You like my combo? <laughs> That's not the tutorial combo, by the way. That is not a tutorial combo, y'all. Try running black with that. He's too good. Too strong. <laughs> that low hitting Cossack was good. Down 4 4 is a great mid. I was thinking how it catches people counter hitting. Thought some while running too. It's good. Bad, bad, bad.
Can I show you my Yoshi? <laughs> I'm not good with Yoshi. I don't know anything about Yoshi in this game. I know nothing. Yeah, I'll take that trade. Damn, what a wasted last round. Wasted last round. <laughs> round one. Fight. Or after you hit him with the down back one, there's a great way to check him and see if they're pressing. What hood am I from? Hey, I'm from, from zone six. East Atlanta. Nice. Look at that damage. Oh my god! Oh my god! Hey! My favorite move to hit people with. <laughs> I'm from Stone Mountain. Uh, I try to do something nice for you guys. You kind of see the moves that I'm using though when I try to explain you guys the Jack's top moves and stuff. You guys see them in action? A lot of running shoulders, a lot of lows, a lot of sledgehammers. And then uh, the supplementary moves they come into play sometimes. This kick, this one, crazy champion. This champion is crazy. You see it, you see it, you see it. The stance is good, but it's like a 50-50 if you want to take it. VR Kaiju, thank you for subbing to the channel, man. Get ready for the next battle. We are at 490, so 10 more, 10 more, and I get my 500. Appreciate it, guys. Fight. A lot of shoulders, a lot of lows. Nice combo. Holy shit. Holy shit. Let's see him whiff something. We can launch. Hey! Bait it. Bait it. The spam lows and shoulder? Hell yeah. Now you're playing Tekken. Now you're playing Tekken. What the fuck? Bam bam. Beesh. Thank you for gifting five subs. See, Beesh made it easier for y'all, man. <laughs> Classic. Let's break that wall. Oh. Fuck. There it is. That's five more gifted. Who's that? Ghosty. Thank you, Ghosty. Appreciate you guys. You guys helped me get there. 
I've got 500 subs now. Round three. Fight. Thank you for gifting five, guys. The five and five. Oh, okay. Like a day school, want to want some of the action too. Mm, 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 I see. You. Fire from Lex 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 Do I like Sicep too? I love Sicep too. Oh, not there though. Not there. Ah! Like a Zazical. Yeah, like, like a Zazical is what he said. Please whip something for me. All right, don't whip. I'm going in. Cover me. Cover me. I'm going in, y'all. Oh, mistake. I'm going in. I'm going in. And I'm going to go hard. And I'm going to go hard. You win. Yeah, that shoulder. That shoulder is fucking strong. That shoulder is strong. Yo, win! Thank you for subbing. We have 506, man. Let's keep going. What that back turn punch he just did? Some new shit. Oh, nice. Okay, the Punisher. Round Danger of Demotion. That's when they fight desperate as fuck. I like it. I like it. Here we go. Boom. 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 Nice duck. Yeah, I'm that guy. I'm him. There's a little setup right there if you hit the power crush. <laughs> Y'all like down four, two, one? I need to start using it for sure. I need to start incorporating it like this. Let's go over the basics again. And then you guys are you guys are gonna be good to go. You guys are all good to go. On your own. Beautiful little jack butterflies, you know? How many lows can we fit in there? Not many. This guy's gonna parry me. But we snuck a few in there though. We snuck a few. I haven't even shoulder tackled yet. I haven't even shoulder tackled or shot my gun. Fuck. I haven't even shot my gun yet. Oh, he's a slider. Sliding specialist. Sliding specialist. <laughs> Loves that hammer as well. I'm 
Nunchuck guarantee you have to slide? Yeah, but they can miss it. If they don't do it right, you better be ready to punish them. Bro, your Wi Fi. Fix it, please. Yeah, he's just gonna slide. Try to slide all day. Let's shoot, let's shoot, let's shoot. See, after this gets blocked, you can run this low. Pretty strongly. Pretty consistent. Every great wall pressure starts with the back two. Oh, he parried for like 10 seconds. Do you have a fang or lay? Oh, I got a little baby fang. Shoulder tackle. Maybe another one. Maybe one of these. Maybe another one of these. Another, another one of these. <laughs> Just go crazy, fuck it. Just go crazy. Oh, he fucked up. Why'd you win? Bow. 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 By the way, if you do down back one and the backs of the wall, down back one one is actually guaranteed. It's a natural combo. You kids might not know that, but it's guaranteed. Bow. They gotta be straight up back to the wall, though. Bomb, bomb. Sometimes I give enough rope to do like a panic move. I let them kill themselves. It's time. It's time. Ah, uh, ah, uh, oh, oh, oh. Uh. <laughs> Round three. That's wall pressure. That's what move I'm about to do. That's what move I'm about to do. <laughs> he beat me too. He beat me too. Fuck it. I'll do it mid screen. It's all about the plus frames. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. That's what move I'm about to do. Oh, I tricked you. I tricked you guys. Thought I was gonna do the. Thought I was gonna do that one, right? I tricked you guys. <laughs> that was that was fun. <laughs>